how does this happen? I have a disaster. Okay. Whew. I don't know how much it weighs, but it's five inches. And if you really let it go out, it's probably more. Alrighty. We had art yesterday. I got my hair cut today. My husband got his hair cut today. And the dog's getting his hair cut today. So it is haircut day in the Allen family. Okay, I got my Patty's journal order yesterday, which I thought I probably would. Let's see. She's in Washington State. I'm in South Carolina. I This is not endorsed. She does not send this stuff to me free. I buy everything. I ordered it when we were at the beach. I think I ordered it Thursday night. Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Got it Monday. From Washington State. She had a couple things on sale. I have five inches of ephemera. <laughs> Look at all this. I opened all the packets. Whoops, that's not it. That's my new little rice cooker. I gotta tell you about that. I mean, oh my god, this is like an old-fashioned game piece. I think I got vintage and I got something else, ephemera packs. I think I paid full price for one and the rest were on sale. Look at this paper. That's screaming. Summer junk journal, isn't it? Okay, so we might go through here a few minutes and find some backgrounds for my pages. Pictures, cut out a couple pictures of things I print. I did at the beach. And again, I printed them just on copy paper because thickness. Yes, I got my hair cut and boy, did I get it cut. I haven't had my hair this short 30 years short. It's real short. No, you're not going to see a picture because I hate getting my picture taken. Let's just say out of all of us put together, my hair got cut the most. <laughs> this was sunrise. This child went with me. I, she, I, she said, Mima, if you go see the sunrise, because she knew I went over Memorial Day. She said, if you go see the sunrise, I said, Bella, it's at six o'clock in the morning, 6.05 to be precise. She, I said, you want me to wake you up? Yep, yep, yep. And she's not a morning person most normally. But I went in her little room and I said, Bella, I'm going to go see the sunrise. You want to come with me? Yes, yes, I do. She got right up. <laughs> I got her a little juice. And I got my coffee. We got the golf cart and we went down to the beach. And she said, oh, Mima, it is beautiful. Yes, it is, isn't it? I mean, she was just a pure delight. Again, I think eight is a magic age, but she's also pretty darn magic. So we were writing in the sand and I wrote beach. She wrote turtles, but she spelled it wrong and I did not correct her. She has had some learning issues with reading and spelling. She has made leaps and bounds thanks to a lovely tutor. And she's seeing her this summer. In fact, she had to write an, every day in a journal over our summer vacation, which has helped her. She was reading license plates. Now she'll be going in the third grade and she is a little behind in her reading, but she's done some great strides. She was, I mean, reading license plates, reading street signs, all kinds of stuff to us, words that she's not used to seeing, which is part of the point. Cause she knows like that child knew fast food restaurants when she was two. Does that tell you something? Never mind, I'm not allowed to talk about it. Okay, I got a new rice cooker that cooks just like um, two, what do you call it? Two portions. And I make my dog's food and it's easier to cook it in a rice cooker because I add rice to it. But this was the instruction booklet, well, instruction DVD. But this is too big for me, but I'm gonna use this as a pattern and trim it down. Wouldn't that be fun in a traveler's notebook or a junk journal or anything, an offered book or anything. So that's a pattern I'm going to work on. Now, all right, my paint dried from yesterday. Dreaming of a house in the sun. And I painted another piece of blue. So I think I'm just going to fast forward at this point and keep working. My pirate showed up good. Ooh, okay. And I'm just doing a little bit of stuff and I'm gonna journal a little bit. And 
add some more stuff. So I've got, hmm, where's my piles now? Look at these great little paper clips. I don't usually add stuff like this, but there are some cute ones now. All right, what's over here? Where'd the food pile go? Maybe I've done all the food, the big pieces. Uh. All right, we're gonna fast forward. Oh, good morning, good morning. I didn't make a video yesterday. Ha! <sighs> my desk was a mess. My schedule was a mess. Not that my schedule is extraordinarily heavy these days. But I am! I am! How many octaves can I go up? I am going to start teaching a quilt class at the library. Um, the library lady came to talk to our group on Monday because they have a new one, the activities lady. And... Um, this is not my county library. This is the next county over, which is like a mile down the road. But these counties overlap a lot. Okay, nice and neat. I can work here now. Um, they are. They have a lot of federal funds, and our county does not get federal funds. We just get taxes. And they have a lot more programs than we do. So I pay to join their library because I do a lot of stuff in the summer. I get a lot of, what happened here? I get a lot of um, books, audio books and stuff from them. Now I just found out that if you have a library card, you can get um, creative bug classes, which is not as big as Craftsy slash Blueprint is, was, but it's not bad. And you can get those classes free. So... It is what it is. It's hard to uh, pass up. And I get the audiobooks free. Um, sometimes I wait for my turn in line, which is no big deal. I get all that. So anyhow, I got all that straightened out. I got my hair cut off. It's short. I mean, it's short. It was this long. Now it's this long. <laughs> um, so uh, some things are coming together. I mean, I just get... I call it journey proud. I get a tad nervous. I'm not a great flyer these days, mainly because I have gotten sick and I'm nervous about getting sick on an airplane. But luckily, it's just my husband and I flying over and back by ourselves. We meet our group and we leave our group early. We meet our group. They've already been there for a day by the time we get there. And we leave a day or two. We leave a week early than one of the groups. And then we leave... Um, a couple days before uh, another part of the group, because the original two, the original couple is going over there because he's volunteering at the British Open in Scotland. I think it's in Scotland, and um, he volunteers at a lot of golf tournaments. This is my husband's closest friend. So um, when they when he found out like two years ago he was going to be able to do this tournament too. We started planning this trip. Well, then my parents went downhill quite rapidly and kind of all, we can't go, we can't go, we can't go. 
then it kind of came back like maybe we can go and then my mom's like no you go and then my sister's like no you go I'll fly out there and help well we don't need that anymore I just need a dog sitter and um what's all in here a glue stick so yeah you, you would think I wasn't, I was not concentrating now, but this is what may, way better than I was yesterday. I was just like, boinga, boinga, boinga. You know how the boinga, boinga stuff happens? Well, that was happening. And I just like fan it. I can't concentrate my, um, oh, uh -huh. my, um, concentration. Ugh. The National, the National Geographic has the 50 years of space, but it also one of the children's magazines that I get for Bella has the whole, the whole magazine is about it. So space might be back on the topic when we get back from Ireland and things calm down. Okay, so I cleaned off my desk. I got everything dried. Um, my head theoretically is better than it was. Um, and now it's much lighter. I washed my hair and I blew it dry and kind of put it where I want it and I got to determine if I want just a fraction of a more trimmed or not but I don't think I do um I was gonna I told the girl yesterday I said please trim it just a little bit but she said no nope. she goes you wash it you style it the way you want it and um oh and I washed the gray out too and um she said then if you want it trimmed even more she said you come back she said but it's gonna dry it's like yeah you're right you're right so anyhow okay life is back to uh, to semi-normal now I can even concentrate here, maybe. So what have I done so far? This is my travel insert. Hmm, I thought I stapled these better than that. For, this whole thing's crooked. Well, okay, it's gonna hold it together for right now. For our beach trip. I was gonna do a traveler's notebook insert. I'm like, no, it was only a couple days and we sunned and we pulled and we sunned and we pulled and oh yeah, we ate and then we sunned and we pulled. <laughs> And beached so I'm just putting a few things down this is the food let's see if we can add a little bit of food embellishments here now we did a lot of ice cream but I don't want to upstage the pirate or this side so that's gonna require a tip in I believe and I have a few um, so now I'm gonna fast forward that's me caught up that's all um, and I found the picture I was looking for yesterday that got me so frustrated the two little munchkins out in the sun The sassy one belongs to us, as usual. Okay, so I'm going to fast forward now. So really, I'm just adding ephemera. Um, magazines, my pictures that I printed on regular paper, um, some of the stuff that I just got from Patty's Art Journals, listening to Irish music, um, stickers, the little sticker, one I point to later on in the video. I think it's from Mrs. Grossman's in 1989. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. I know. I know. <laughs> Ridiculous. But I'm really, really focusing on trying to use some of this stuff up. My picture from sunrise at 6 o'clock in the morning. Um, really, really, really. <clears throat> Just putting things down and leaving some spots that I can journal. Um, and trying to use up a lot of stuff. Admittedly, sometimes I have too much stuff to choose from, and I don't have to use it all. So, if I don't use it all, that's fine. I'm
of stuff at times and pictures and that's it over and over again so I'm just going to play some music <laughs> 